A big challenge that comes with working with smaller pieces of stock is being able to sand without removing a hair of your own skin or nail in the process. Adding a sanding block to a vise works, but with their small surfaces, they really only work for very small items. If you have a dog hole on the front of your bench, you can make what I call a dog sanding board. I screwed a piece of thin stock to the front of a piece of plywood that will hold the jig tight against the table. With the spade bit, I mark the location of the dog hole from the bottom up and move the mark a 30 second towards the edge. This makes it clamp on after I've added my dowel. If you have a vise, the same can easily be done by clamping the stock you added and bypassing the dowel completely. The plywood is the width and a little less of a piece of standard sandpaper. To clamp it on, fold the edges of the sandpaper and add a couple F clamps. Besides being able to clean the face of small things easily, I even found I could sharpen dull chisels with the finer sandpaper I bought in a multi-pack. If you like that sanding tip, I have 10 more in a full-size video. Pin in the comments. Sub and follow for more bite-sized tips. Keep making things.